friends, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zealot, and we're here today doing the Alpha 8.5 Anniversary Update series. And you can see I've done a bunch of work on the base here. I've textured it and painted it. And, and so here's the hangar. I just parked the, um, the little HV miner out of the way here. It kind of fits nice and snug right in between the stairs and sentry gun, so perfect. Um, so I'll take you a little tour downstairs. So there's my uh, emergency generator backup, which has had to actually run a few times now, unfortunately. We had a cloudy day and it like drained my... You can see it's building up a charge now because the consumption is lower than the output. The solar output and that will get up to like one point I added up to about 1.7 megawatts I think on a really hot sunny day uh, it was good but on a cloudy day it, it couldn't keep up and I was doing a whole bunch of building with a whole bunch of stuff and it drained the battery down and I noticed it dipping into the fuel finally I'm like oh wow so not bad though I mean and it's building up again now that the sun's back up and that was overnight so i had everything cranked overnight and it and it drained the battery oh well my bad um during the day constructing it does not drain the battery it seems i can just go for it doesn't really charge up much though if i'm doing that but it does slowly charge it uh, i put in an atm so i've got my two advanced constructors and the large constructor i'm using the large for smelting right now I do sort of have plans to put a furnace in. I more want to do a deconstructor. So I was thinking deconstructor furnace maybe over here. I'm just not sure because the, the furnace is really, I'd have to like knock a hole in the wall or something to push it back. Or I can use this room. So this room was, uh, I pretty much haven't even touched it. I just textured it and repaired what damage there was. So, so this is all just from digging this thing out. It's, it was pretty much like this already. I actually removed a bunch of blocks. So it was, it was really easy to just use it because it was like already built. <laughs> it, 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 it just works. It's like, holy crap. Hey, I can just use this as a base. So... I did that, and you can see it's it's worked out quite well. So my garden is uh, is flourishing. Whoops. Uh, I got all I got a plot of pretty much everything, and you can see a bunch of things are ready to pick now. So I got my uh, sweetener and uh, uh, stimulant going. I've got everything else going here, as you can see, and I'm. I looked it up and I tried optimizing the best for the best yield for uh, plot size and everything in time. So this is what I went with. I went with uh, two uh, two three by three plots of spice and a three by three plot each of the wheat pumpkins um, natural sweetener. Uh, this is the, well, this is the, what, the alien honey plant, I think it was called. Uh, this is the um, orange, the space orange. Uh, the, so that has the best yield. You can see pick up eight times fruit, big time. Um, and this is the only choice you have right now for the stimulant is these plants. Uh, this is the only choice you have for the herbal leaves, mushrooms, and uh, fiber. So the only ones you can really choose what you want are the grains, the vegetables, and the fruits. Pretty much everything else you're stuck with, with the uh, with the single crop type, because that's the only crop available that gives that yield. So, um, yeah, so it's going good. That I, I just got one more of the. Uh, natural stimulant and sweetener and then that's pretty much the garden is pretty much done so so here we are up on the um, 
garden and I'll show you the is this the bridge here yeah so this used to be the bridge I've now turned it into the bedroom <laughs> oh sun's out so the up there you can just see the uh, um, here is there any critters out I don't see any let's get our gun out just in case reload Okay, so as you can see, it's the sun's starting to go down. Or no, that's the east. It's actually just coming up. Okay. So anyway, there's the uh, solar panels up on the top there. It's kind of a cloudy day. We're not going to get optimum sun, so we're not going to we're not going to get like uh, like even a megawatt. I doubt. Let's see what it's at right now. So it looks like it's charging. Yeah, it's at, it's at about half of what it should be. It's because it's cloudy out. Well, it's still, it's charging, so that's good. I mean, it means, it means even on a cloudy day, it's not using up any fuel, and it's charging the battery. So that means it only dips into the fuel a little bit at night on cloudy days. Other than that, it actually sustains it and charges it enough to be able to sustain it for night. As long as you're not going crazy with, you know, like a furnace or something, then you're... And, and turn things off when you're not using them. So what I want to do today is... Um, I was going to set up a switch for a bunch of the lighting, but I think what we need to do is actually build an SV, and I've got all the parts made. So let's go do that. We're going to go into the hangar here. Okay, so let's do this. Get our small vessel starter. We've got some steel blocks. And I don't want to make it so it's too big to fly out, right? That would suck. Okay, so I think what we want to do is we want to kind of do my, um, yeah, I'm going to be removing, I'm going to be removing all that crap to tell you the truth. Um, now I'm wondering... So I've only got three of the rocket launchers. I didn't have enough to make the other capacitor devices. Where are they here? Oh, they're still in the thing. Okay, so the guns are still in there. I'm wondering if I should put the guns in first or... No, you know what? Let's do the... Let's do the cockpit. Let's do the cockpit. So uh, what I want to do is I want to actually build a box tight around the cockpit. Now I know it sounds ridiculous, like why would I do that? I just want to extend this out a bit just so it doesn't tip over on me because you can actually unbalance a vehicle and it'll tip and then it sucks to build after that. Okay, it sucks to work on anyway. Um, so basically what I want to do here, I'm just going to hang back. I'm going to do my drone. Now I should probably do symmetry tool. Okay, so we want that there. Basically, we're gonna bolt. We're gonna block this in completely. We're gonna completely block it in. <laughs> 
I know it sounds ridiculous, but it's um, it actually it works really well, and it puts it puts my avatar at exactly the same spot every time, regardless of of uh, angle or anything that I'm that I'm at. If the ship's on an angle or something for some reason. Um, I know this is looking ridiculous, like nobody ever does this, right? But I do. And I did, and it worked. So I'm doing it again. Okay, that's got to be sealed in. Okay, the reason why I'm doing it so tight like this is so that there is no space for anywhere else except so you can see I can't actually put anything on there because it's actually taking up that space so I'm gonna go like this yeah I know these are just steel blocks but it's okay now this is getting a little Oops, I didn't want to do that. That's okay. That's okay. I can remove them. I just didn't want it tipping. Uh, and, it, and usually it's okay until you jump in the cockpit. So, but, I don't know, that's... Knowing my luck, I, uh, I'll be screwed. Okay, so I think... I think what I want to be doing here... Hmm. It's hard to say. Let's just box this in. Let's just box this in. Okay. You know what? We need that, like that, and yeah, all the way. Okay. Okay, that's ridiculous, but that's the way it is. Okay, so now, what I want to do is I don't want to use up all the space with just blocks. I want to use up the space with appropriate gear. So, um, I'm going to put that, so I should put the core there, put the core on the top, or is that, is I going to put the core there? No, I was going to put it there. Okay. So let's do that. I got another core. We're going to pop the core right now before we get too serious. Where to put the other core? It is in the constructor. Okay. Let's grab it. <coughs> and I can grab some more of this stuff. Uh, yeah, an SV detector. Woo! Exciting. That is exciting. Okay. Uh, I need to grab that, put that there. Okay. Okay, so let's pop. Oh, I don't have space to pop it, do I? Got one, one thing. Okay, so let's dump some stuff here. This is ridiculous. Um, okay, we're going to the med processor for now. Let's dump all my meds. 
need every image I have right now currently on me. Alright, a little crazy. Okay. I was making meds, by the way. I can make meds. Uh, yeah, I can still make another one. Let's make another one. Good, good. Nice. So, eggs are very important. Make sure you save your eggs. You're going to need eggs. You're going to need mushrooms. You're going to need all the alien parts and alien tooth. Um, yeah, very important. The eggs. The eggs are very important to make these. Okay. So, now that we have space, let's pop this core. And we'll just replace it with a regular block for now. Uh, oh wait, no, I didn't need to do that. Uh, actually, you know what, I'll just do that for now. Um, and then I should actually do boxes though. I'm all torn on how I want to do the floor if I wanted to do it cargo boxes, which I think I should and like the the constructor and stuff I probably should okay yeah let's do that let's because we, we need to really feng shui this really feng shui it so I know by doing that it sounds ridiculous, but um, all the much more reason to finish with it. So, should we spin that, put it like that? Because that's not, it's not airtight, so it would have to be airtight around it. I could rotate it, put it like that, and then, and then we can have um, cargo boxes on the floor that are airtight. Cargo boxes, I know you exist. Where are you? There you are. Okay, so we can have. Airtight true, airtight false, false true. So that's a double one. So we could go like that. <clears throat> we could do two. Let's do two. Yeah, we'll do two. Okay. So, hmm, so we're going to build this out. So we need guns, guns, and that's got to go in the middle, so that. So one, two down, three down from the top is the middle. Okay. So three down from the top is the middle. Let's take, I don't really know what to take actually. I don't know. I don't think I should put a gun there. Let's not do that. That's probably stupid. Let's just put more blocks. You know what? Let's just... Let's just... We're going to actually upgrade, I think, some. Do we have any plates on us? No? Okay. Let's grab those. If we can. Do we have any? Yep. Let's see if we can upgrade. So, whoops.
So yeah, it looks like we can. Get the cockpit upgraded. Just the front of it. We're gonna potentially be taking blast. Okay. So there we go. That'll help. Um, now we want to stick more so we want a couple more out there here let's those need to be upgraded for sure okay um, I know it looks ridiculous right now, but just, just bear with me, bear with me. One, two. trying to get it so that it won't look completely stupid that's three so let's do three I'm going to obviously be removing blocks, don't worry, this isn't what it's going to look like, I'm just trying to get it centered. For guns and stuff, okay. Okay, so I think we want... Um, that like tucked right in I think we do or do we uh. have that come down on an angle yeah let's try this let's try this okay have somewhat of a vision. It can be muddy sometimes, but and I need I need to like filter out the particulate sometimes to, to, to actually find what I'm looking for, but I will find what I'm looking for. Okay, and then Okay, so I think now let's let's do this. We're gonna we're gonna what? We're gonna what? We're gonna. You know what? I think I think we're gonna take. Oops! No, no, no. I'm gonna take this out. No, that shouldn't. Yeah, that should be fine. Okay. So 
So, let's do this. I'm gonna... Hmm, should I do the one on the top or the bottom? Let's do the one on the top. I'll have to leave the one on the bottom out for now. I just don't have enough mats to actually make it. So... Ah! Stupid thing. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Oh! Oh, I don't have... No! I just destroyed one. I don't have the core in. Oh, I'm a moron. Oh. if we have enough mats. Ugh, no, we're not going to have the mats for it. We're not going to have the mats. I wrecked it! I wrecked it! Eh, crap. Yep. We're going to have two missile launchers now. <laughs> We're down to two missile launchers. Blah! Uh. Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay, this is a little unconventional. Because I really need... I need this stuff right now. I really need it, so... Just... I, I know what you're thinking. Oh, wait, I won't be able to do this. Will I? Will I? No, I won't be able to do this. Crap. I don't have a deconstructor either. Hmm. Hmm. Well, it looks like I'm going to be having to go over to the Titan to finish off the... Um, finish off the missiles. Oh well, you know what? We're going to live without the two missiles for now. We're going to just run with the two. We'll do we'll run a little lopsided, but I don't care. So, let's get some more blocks on here. So normally that would be one there, so that would be full, 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 and full, okay. And then we're going to go like this. Okay. I know it looks ridiculous right now, but just uh, give it a chance, give it a chance, give it a chance. I think we can run symmetrical at this point. Let's try it. Let's put a, let's put a um, symmetry plane up. So I'm going to hit N while I'm looking at it. I'm going to go for a symmetry plane. I'm going to do the YZ front to back. And then I want to do it in between the center block. So that looks perfect. Hit N again to get rid of that. So now whatever I put in, it will duplicate on the other side of it. So including any screw ups. Now. Okay, so I think we're just going to put regular blocks here, filled right there and there. And then same with here, these are regular block. Okay. And then, oh, I'm actually kind of looking the 
liking a bit of the chunky look here. Huh. Let's see what this is going to look like if I do this, though. If I do that, back one, and then back one. Interesting. And then what, what would I do for there? Hmm. No, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do what I had originally in mind. Okay. So that should be that should be a regular block, right? That should be like one of those. Yeah. Okay. And then same with this. Okay. Now we've got to leave that open because of that. So, because of that, because we're going to leave it open, we're going to put solid blocks in there. Uh, okay, time to do some upgrading on interior blocks while we have them in sight. Sorry, the camera is really jerky for some reason. Trying not to make it too, too, too excessively heavy. I don't want to. I don't want to do the whole thing in armor. Basically, just the front of it. So I'm guessing I should probably just put a solid block in here and upgrade that. Does it upgrade the other side? But no, it doesn't. Okay. Um. What else? Do I do a... So how is this going to work? Is this going to be like... Like this? And then... Like this? Possibly. And then we can do the 
lights. Yeah, lights. It's perfect for lights. I don't have enough. Oh man, but that is like, okay, so I need to make five lights. It's like tailored made for lights. They're gonna get blown up, obviously, but that's not where the weapons are, right? And I've got enough of a bulkhead now. There was, what, three or four frickin' blocks, right? So, you know, I think this is going to be excellent lighting. Oops. That one in there. Okay, so I need to get two more lights and I can put them facing up and down. Uh, that'll that'll be really good. That'll be good. Okay, so let's upgrade this. <laughs> My lights are going to get popped all the time. But you know what? I expect that. I totally expect my lights to get blown up all the time. And a lot of times they'll just carry spares with me. Uh, okay, speaking of, let's get a couple more. So we'll make a couple more lights. I don't have any on me. No. No. Okay. So two more of the spotlights. Okay. Excellent. Grab this stuff now too. Okay. So we want to put the lights just top and bottom these ones here so that one and we'll just rotate that like that okay so there's our front <laughs> um Potentially the the weapons array, so it's going to be four four Gatling guns and four um, rocket launchers in that array around it like that. That way they're spread out enough. I think that uh, one lucky shot with a frickin' missile doesn't take all of them out at once. Uh, you actually have to purposefully aim at each one now so I think that's a much better uh, spread good and yeah I just need some more Neo and Sath and I can build the other two but in the meantime we do have two so we can maybe take on the armory or something um, well how are we doing on time I think what we're going to do is we're going to break this into a few smaller episodes, this, the construction of this. And so we're going to break here. Um, it's coming along though. You can see it's, it is kind of going to be a bulky ship. Uh, there's not going to be a lot of, there's not going to be room for a second passenger at all. At all. <laughs> um, yeah, there's just going to be standing room only in the, in a space right here. There's going to be a box top style to it. You'll see when it's done. You'll see it'll 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 handle okay as a starter vessel. Um, we could probably upgrade the engine and stuff and add more later on and, and make it more of a mid game better vessel and who knows. But in the meantime, we're going to leave it here. We've got a good start on it. We're going to need definitely more blocks, so I'm going to get a bunch more blocks building. And uh, until next time, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.